I'm Roger with Synthesizers.com and here's how to control gate length on your Q960 sequencer. On a typical Q960 patch, you'll use the Q960's internal oscillator to create gates to drive your envelope generators. When you do it this way, the gate output of the Q960 is a 90% duty cycle. That means the gate stays on for 90% of the time for each note. We can change that and change the sound drastically by using the Q961 to control the length of the gate. We'll get our new gate from here and we'll patch the clock output over into the second column, which is adjustable. Another option for controlling gate length is to use a Q106 oscillator to control the Q960 sequencer instead of using its internal oscillator. We do that by using the pulse wave output and then we can control the pulse width manually using this control or with voltage control. We'll use the pulse output from the Q106 oscillator to drive our gates. We'll also use that to shift our Q960 sequencer. Now the Q106 oscillator controls the speed of the sequence. And the pulse width control controls the length of each gate.